What's up guys, going on? It's your boy here, Ryan Rap Beats. How's everybody doing? Today, uh, we're doing some embroidery work. We're doing this job right here. Um, just got it digitized. And here's the, uh, the details of it. So we're going to be... Um, uh oh. All right, anyways, uh, yeah, so we're going to be doing a stitch out, but first we're gonna have to load the old USB to the machine. Let's go ahead and do that. Put that in there. Load it up. Uh, so if you guys know or have one of the older Tajimas or the emulator USB, it's always finicky. So always gotta just use it a couple of times, do it a couple of times, blow it like the old Nintendo. Hopefully it shows up to Academy. That's what it is. Now we're doing hats. So we're gonna have to fix this up. So let's go ahead. Okay, it's loaded. Let's go to our colors. Let me do that real quick. So we're doing gold. Okay, now we're going to be, make sure this is rotated 180 because we're doing hats. Okay, now first color is, uh, what is it, 13. This thing gotta move around. Let's go ahead and do our stitch out and take this thing out. This is the old artwork. It's gonna look something similar to this one. All right, let's go ahead and pop this thing in. Gotta do it one handed. All right, let's do our trace. a little bit oh. okay that looks good let's do our stitch out let it ride All right, so we're gonna do our stitch out, wait for it to finish, and uh... Oh, it's a little bit smaller, I forgot. Okay, so yeah, this is the hats we're gonna be working on. There's one of these dad hats from uh, Yukon. I got this thing loaded up already. But we're gonna wait for that, make sure our color scheme is correct for the paper, and make sure if we need to make any changes, now it's time, so that's how we do this picture. All right. We actually came from this design to this design to this one and then this one so um yeah these were these ones look great but the the design of it because it's so small the the social part of it does, doesn't look right so we kind of changed it up made it this way it looks way better and got rid of the um the little outline thing but yeah we're gonna go with this one To our trace. I think they look good. I think they look good. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's 
Now, like I was saying, I have 50 of them to do. Here's all the hats. Um, I'm usually averaging about 10 to about, I don't know, about 13 minutes. Let's just say, worst case, 15 minutes a hat. So I have 50 of them. So if I do four, if I do four within what? Oh, stop. But if I do four within like what, an hour? Maybe five within an hour. Um, that'll give me roughly around 12 hours to finish this job. Right, guys it is day three which is wednesday um it's roughly around 10 30 in the morning um this is the last hat so let me let me kind of figure out what time so we started around five ish on monday five six seven eight nine ten so that's five hours monday and i did what uh three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven plus eight hours yesterday, which is Tuesday. So that's 13 hours. And plus right now it's what? Uh, started around seven, eight, nine, 10. I can say 11, four hours. What is that? Where did I count? 16 hours? No wait, 17 hours? Whatever. All right, so we did change the design to that instead of, instead of the, something like this with a little outline so we did change it because it just didn't look right especially on this hat uh, with that outline it, sh it shrunk down the uh, the logo so we got rid of it I think it looks way better um, we also did a we did some shirts for them there's the other hats here so we, did, we did shirts for them just uh, some Bella canvas um, was it mustard yellow so this mustard yellow with that logo on there we kept the outline on this one pretty dope but that's the last batch so yes it took way longer than expected well not expected i know it's gonna take long um but you know it's one machine one embroidery machine and it's just doing everything so it's just watching paint dry definitely need to get a multi-needle multi-needle machine, not a multi-needle, multi-head uh, machine. It'll definitely speed up the process. At least if I get two head or another head, it'll cut that in half, you know, but I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I need to look into it. Um, I do need another, another machine, at least one more machine to make it two or whatever, but one head's not gonna cut it. I thought I could push it out as long as I can, just, you know, to not get another machine, but it looks like we're gonna have to look into getting another machine. All right, guys, well, that's it. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, like, subscribe, and share if you haven't done so. All right, have a good one. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Keep grinding, peace out.